pray. Allow me to show you the way. You know what? Let's do it. Well, if you insist. I'm only glad I don't have to lead the way for a change. We're following you, Darcy. <laughs> it seems Darcy's arisen has completed this quest already. And this pawn will lead me straight there. Hopefully this is the first of many instances in which a pawn will lead me to completion of a quest. Uh, pointing the way and everything. This is great. Oh my, Harpy's circling that right. Ballista Tower. Huh. Oh, wow. Yeah, we're, we're leaving the city and already performance is increasing quite a lot. Fascinating. So, just stick to the main road. Avoid all possible distractions, hopefully. Those aren't bandits, are they? Uh, we'll find that goblin den. Curious thing. One of my former masters chose to hire only women. What? We've got problems. No means of exploiting our weakness. Oh, look at that! Rank 4 fighter! Huh. I... oh, Barrios. Hell yeah. I wonder if we're any closer to... Uh, catching the eye of that fighter maester we ran into in Melv. Hmm. It seems Darshi is picking the trail back up, so that's good. Oh, that's a... Uh, great. Come. I'll lead the way. Let's walk by and not get the attention of that Cyclops. Right, please, please, I don't want to fight one. <laughs> and there's Boreas. Fist bump, hell yeah. Rank four. Two peas in a pod. Oh, is that a ruined cart like what was mentioned? A treasure chest. Oh? Shall we see if we can't make our way over to it? Up there. No. We have places to be. It's certainly the right trail. But of course Darcy knows the way, so the point is moot. Level 10. Not bad. Oh. Wait, what? Oh, for the love of... Okay, let's put that new ability to the test. Or not. Wow, did a lot of damage. Do you see that? Or... No. You know what? I upgraded my weaponry. That's right. I got a new sword and upgraded besides. So I am doing a lot of damage. Damn. Good shot, Paps. There's Boreas leveled up. Yeah, this has the make of goblins, alright. It's... It looks like... All oh, this scaffolding. Goblins didn't make these. Is this some sort of mine, do you suppose? One never can have too many of these. What say we pelt one of the next foe we encounter? You found the goblin's lair. Well. No, wrong button. Lantern on, everyone. Into the dark. It's about time we pressed on, wouldn't you say, Master? The Treble Mine. That's right, they did say it was a mine. Knock, knock! <laughs> I'm going to throw this at the next goblin I see. For the love of... That's a barrel! Okay, okay, we're good. 
I think it just blew itself up. <laughs> ah, this being a mine, we can gather a lot of ores. Always good to get a stockpile going. Really, it dropped its torch and it hit me? Let my magic you an elemental oh, I need to be more defensive. Well, the, the path splits here. Let us make doubly sure which will see us to our destination. For the love of... Yeah, I see you. You want some? Who's next? Dang it. Your magical hide has dissipated. Fry cast it at you. Good. We're good. Collect that. You needn't trouble yourself. There's a chest. Well, our pawns are really happy to loot stuff for me, huh? A two-hander! Well done, Babs. Excellent. Now we need to find an arc staff and we can get out of here, but no, I want to fully explore this, I think. Be quite nice. Opening locked doors. There are some doors that can be interacted with, but cannot be opened by keys or mechanisms. This can merely be a matter of timing, or you may find that such doors will be opened to a particular time of day, or once you have progressed to a certain point in the story. Take note of any intriguing doors you encounter, try revisiting them again at a later time. Screw that, I'm just gonna knock it down. I said, it's gonna knock it down. Let us utilize our individual strengths wherever possible. Uh, maybe if we can find an explosive barrel. Or if I was a mage, I could... If I can light it on fire. Let's see here. How's that? Eh, I tried. What? I'm not okay. I'm not doing that move again with a low roof. Hello, can I loot that goblin? There we go. Speaking of low roofs, here's a tall roof. Whoa. Whoa. What is in here? Ranger's tights. Maybe archer stuff. Boy, those goblins know no fear. <laughs> Gotta admit, the gumption is respectable. Just launch straight at us, but it's not smart. No, sir. So actually, let me take a look at that... those pants. Uh, oh! Maybe Boreas can wear it. Uh, huh. My god, it's an upgrade. Oh! That's not just an upgrade, it's a substantial upgrade, and, um... Oh, the things I do for stats. Oh, no! <laughs> what in the... This dwarf butt is hanging out, man. Oh my god! Dorshi got downed! Uh huh. If you leave a pawn immobile, in an immobile state, for a prolonged length of time, it will become forfeit and will be forcibly removed from the party. Uh, if multiple pawns lie immobile in the vicinity, the Arisen can revive them simultaneously. 
The maximum health of the revived pawn will be equal to the Arisen's remaining health. Interesting. Oh my god, what is that? That's a big one. And it's defensive. Oh, that might be a hobgoblin. I am saved. Thank you, Arisen. Whew. What is that? Just drop some gold. It's like it's got like a like a blackish greenish skin color instead of the goblin orange tan. Huh. There's a way across there. I imagine if I broke this. <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> That's so cool. Well, well. Follow me surprised. I'm cool. I do cool things. Do you see that, guys? Are you proud of me? Bab saw it. She saw it. You saw it too, didn't you? <laughs> Gold ore. Now that's going to be worth holding on to, methinks. That looks promising. Any ideas as to how we might reach it? Oh, Darcy's found a chest. Oh, there it is. Could be the Ark Staff. Maybe. Explosive arrows. Yeah, that's fine. Speaking of explosives, here's barrels. There's writing on the side. Um. Oh, wow, you can see the daylight from here. And there's a bridge above. Wow. Pick up every little thing you find. Fascinating. I wonder if I can't escort this barrel back to that closed door. That would be nice to find out, but... I'd have to drop with this. Okay, hopefully this doesn't explode in my face. Pray for me. Can I... Oh, and do not put it near the fire. <laughs> Babs, come on! <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> oh, is this the way back? No, I think this might be a new route. Oh, put it, put it down. Where is this going? Oh, Making our report grievous horns. That would be the Arcus staff. Wait, Arcus staff? Arcus staff? That's just Arc staff in the first game. No, oh, well. Well, we can complete the quest, and rest assured, I will not be port crystalling out. That would be a colossal waste. We're right next door to the big city. Uh, we can come back here. What's down here? Oh my god, Boreas. No shame. <laughs> Fantastic. They're unaware. Oh, come on! I love being a fighter. It's pretty great. Can I? A chest. Let me in. Ah, I need to find another route. Yeah, when I become a sorcerer, I'm gonna miss knocking people around with a shield, that's for sure. Oh. Sleeping, I see. Wakey, wakey. Yeah, you're a big boy. Reign of Cooling. Huh. What does that do? Uh, reduces damage taken from fire. Yeah, I'll equip that. Sure. I did my best to match your skill, Master. Is that a boulder? Yeah, help me, Babs. Roll it on these enemies. Ow. Kill the big one. Boss pinned down. Oh my god. 
fire. Good holding it down, Boreas. Oh! Poor mage got cornered. There. Ah, you're not long for this world. That was a big group. Ooh, nice shot, Babs. Is it gonna hit anyone? No. Oh. I see. Well, I am really glad I did not come into this room from the other exit. We ought to consider this a lesson. What a mess. This is what befalls one who lets down their guard. Slate colored horn. Yeah, that's totally a hobgoblin. That's a drop from the first game that hobgo hobgoblins could drop. In fact, um, didn't I need a slate colored horn for upgrading something? Hmm. Oh, around here. I think this might connect back to the first split. Yes, it does. All right, all right. I got my bearings. Though, I have a feeling there's plenty left to uncover in this cave, so... Let's keep an eye out. God, this camera is a bit claustrophobic, I'll admit. Yeah, I can't lob the barrel that high. Crap. Huh. I'll have to come back and keep this in mind. There's yet a secret to find in this place, but I can't reach it. That's a shame. Anyhow, let's make for the entrance. Hopefully, it's still daylight. Oh, it's night time. This is going to be a bit interesting. Huh. Wow, I can see the castle Ill illuminated. Interesting. Whoa! The cave at last. The air beneath the earth is stifling, to be sure. Big flying griffin. True enough. Good thing we're not going that way. I thought there might be something here. Savagery extract. What is that? Boost your strength and magic for a period of time. Oh, right, the combined pariah thing. Neat. A pariah, I should mention, is a consumable in the first game that could boost either your strength or your um, magic, but not both at the same time. You had to choose. Did I really pass this by? Wait. That armor, is that... You can count on me to fly to your aid in your hour of need, Master. Knowing when to use curatives is my specialty. Huh. This pawn is definitely not from Capcom, but... They're wearing... The corset and the... the even the daggers? You know what? This pawn is hacked. I refuse to believe this is even possible. A hacker made this pawn. Get the hell out of my game. Where'd they go? Hello? Hey, no. I said get out of my game. Is that you say? That's what I think of cheating. I feel dirty just walking near that pawn. Oh! That's a gold beetle, right? Yes! Ooh, they pop out pretty well at night. Huh. So it seems Boreas is fond of walking in front of me, and I can't stop looking at his butt! Ha! Ah! The hell are these? Spirits? Phantoms. Oh no, I need a weapon enchantment. I can't hurt them with physical, right? Now I can. They're fast. 
Wow, they can't enter Anodyne. They hate Anodyne. Interesting. They're dead. Wow, those looked really, really cool. What a cool encounter. Ah, uh, there's a campsite, but yes, because we're so close to the city, I didn't actually bother, um... Wait, what? Get it, what? There's something... What is this mark on the map? This gold... Right, I don't have a campsite with me, so I can't camp out for the night, but... What is this mark? What is... I can't make much out from here. But I have a feeling it will be worth the climb. Answering pawn suggestions with go. Um, yeah, yeah, I already did that. But who? What? Got any uh, interesting tidings to share? Sella. Say, might you do me a favor? I've been hearing all sorts of rumors about you and how mighty you are, and I thought to myself, now if ever you need an escort, that's what who you want. I got an errand to see to far afield? No, no, bad timing, Sulla. I feel like that's a randomly generated quest. Interesting, but... Alright. Ah, cripes. Enough dawdling. Let's just get to town. Oh, right. That guy. You know what? This will make a nice finale for this expedition in the field. Oh, 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 oh blocking's that scary, but it's doable. Make for the head. So legs are vulnerable. Has tusks, I can break them off if I want. Hopefully. Die! Oh, that was a big stab. He hated it. Whew. Alright, he's angry. Oh, break the earth. He's got. I've got his attention. Target me, not my mages and archers, right? Come on, this way. Oh, thank goodness he doesn't do a double swing. Oh. Yeah, I smashed off the armor on his legs. Ow. This flailing got me. Oh, he's, uh, he's on fire. It's good. Ow. I think I blocked that in time. You know what? Yeah! Let's try knocking him off. Uh, I want to knock him off balance, damn it. Stamina. Oh, I'm standing on him. Uh oh. Is that balance? Yeah. Come on, I want to knock him off balance. I know if I can sprint at him and grab, I'll hate it. Here we go. Ooh! Finishing blow. Just like before. And perfect, I leveled up. Oh, Tarsha wants a high five on the burning Cyclops corpse. Hell yeah! Or he's leveled up too. Rugged Bones! Yeah, I think I needed that. 
for um upgrading something. Ow. Well that was nice. Oh good adventure. Good adventure this was. Let's head straight into town. Hand in that stuff. Unlock new vocations. And honestly, um I ranked up my vocations at the outset of this journey so I can buy some new stuff too. I feel like I'd get a quest if I talk to them, so let's not. Me, hey, dude. But I cannot guide you. Good tidings, sir. How fares your retrieval of those plundered weapons? I passed with flying colors. Pre present the Arca staff. Huh, eighty magic. Wow, that's not a lot, but. Oh ho! You have procured an archer staff, I see. Archer staff, huh? Most excellent. You may now change your vocation to sorcerer, if it pleases you, sir. It would. However, if you wish to register as a warrior instead, you will need to acquire a great sword. Well, about that, sir. Good tidings, sir. How fares your retrieval of those plundered weapons? Marvelous. You have acquired both an archer staff and a great sword. You may now change your vocation as desired, sir. What's more, I bear glad tidings. It would seem our arms shortage is at an end. I dare say the armory will be resupplied anon. Ah, I can buy weapons for those vocations now. Neat. Unlock warrior. Quest complete. Have you business with the guild, sir? Yes, I yes I do. Um... Let us acquire new stuff. I can upgrade Blink Strike to Burst Strike. Oh, it's expensive, though. It looks like it's much faster, and it covers more distance. Hmm. Compass Slash or... Ooh, Gouging Skewer. Thrust a blade into the target's body before raining further blows upon them. Oh my god, that's brutal! If the user clings to larger targets and pins down smaller targets that are flinching. Wow. Oh my god, that's incredible. But yeah, you'd be super vulnerable. Huh. Uh, shield bash is now shield pummel. Ooh. Strikes a target twice. It looks like it comes out way faster too. I might want to buy that one. Impeccable guard. Whoa! The spins nimbly on the spot, blocking attacks from every direction with the shield. Employable even while flinching. <gasps> Yo, I need that. I always get, like, ganged up and stunned. Oh, so many good things. Wow, 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 wow. Okay. Uh, core skills. Enchanted counter. When using defend while enchanted, automatically counters with an elemental attack corresponding to the enchantment. Yes. Okay. Augments. Provocation. Do I want foes to target me a lot? No. Uh, okay, so. Um. Let's grab that shield pummel. Oh, I can't get impeccable guard. That's a shame. Oh, well. We'll just sit as is. Anyway, Boreas, your turn. You have Cutting Wind, Advanced Form of Biting Wind. Extended Attack Range, easier to use. Ignited Blades, a longer lasting effect, can also be employed while clinging to or pinning down a foe. Yeah, that would be pretty useful, though we do have a mage who can provide fire enchantment. Um, Smokescreen. Huh. Crit chaos when counterattacking or withdrawing. Yeah, it looks like it does stun that goblin a little bit. Mm. How about core skills? Footpad. Kicks off a wall, allowing the user to launch themselves a great distance. Wow! I mean, 
that's really cool for a player character, but I don't know if a pawn would ever make use of that, like, ever. And augments. Slightly restore health. You know, I may as well. And weapon skills. Let's get a better ignited blades. Cool. Uh, all right. All right, all right. So, vocations. I can actually equip, um, equip a new vocation. So, I'd like to at least get that quest from the Maester of Fighters back at Melv. Honestly, I think I might be good to just wait until I'm rank 9, and then even then I'll probably spend a little bit of time playing around at max rank before swapping off. Alright. The state of things makes my lot rather difficult. Always a pleasure. Thank you, Klaus. You've been a huge help. Now then, um... Oh! Alright, it's night time! We need to go talk to the guy! Uh, let's do that. Who are you We're... there? Oh, Your what? Your presence is requested at the tavern this evening. Yeah, I just remembered. <laughs> let's go. Wow, a lively inn. Oh, there he is. Brant, was it? Your Majesty. Your timing is impeccable. I just thought to call for you. Tis not a matter for prying ears. Pray, let us speak out here. All right, lead the way, sir. Oh yeah. Uh, prying ears, you say? I feel like. Anyone could listen to this very, very easily. Can we go into like that secluded guardhouse we talked to me in earlier? But uh, whatever. As I informed you when last we spoke, the palace is filled with the Queen Regent's sycophants. Should Deesa denounce Your Majesty as a false arisen, few would elect to doubt her. Uh huh. I'm kind of scared to hear what you're gonna suggest next. Yet if we are to prove your identity. I believe there is no occasion more suitable than the coronation. Oh. It was delayed so that the sovereign, that is, the false arisen, could convalesce in the palace. But the date has now been set. I see. Oh. Oh, if the date is set, uh, we might be running into a timed main quest here. The central players Maybe. in the court ought all be in attendance. It would be a fine opportunity to display your majesty's power. Yes. I think, I think we have the element of surprise. I don't think Queen Deza knows that we're here. She thinks she's safe and that I've been sent to the jail and I'm still there with no way of escape. But if I could just barge right in and display in front of all the nobles the proof that I am arisen. None would be able to deny that you are the true arisen then. There is a problem, however. Entry to such an event is limited to the chosen few. So, Brant, how do I get in? Only select members of the nobility and citizens who have contributed greatly to Vermont's continued prosperity will be granted entry. If your majesty is to be counted among them, you will need to attend to a number of tasks. Pray, allow me to summarize them for you. Ah, laundry list, I see. And tell me of Monster Culling, the Queen Regent... The Magistrate? Ah... Uh, you know, we just did some adventuring. Let's stick to the town. Uh, tell me about this Magistrate. Of all those who serve the Queen Regent, there is but one who I have no doubt will lend his support to your Majesty's cause. I refer to Waldar, a Magistrate. Many a time has Deza demanded Waldor amend the Code of Vermon to her own benefit. And many a time has the Magistrate refused her. For he's loyal to none but the spirit of the law. As a result, he now sits in a cell beneath the palace. Wow, Deza sucks. Our laws dictate that your majesty is our rightful ruler. Thus, as the staunchest supporter of the law known to the palace, I'm quite confident that Waldor will be willing to vouch for your majesty. What say you? Might you be willing to aid me in arranging the magistrate's release? Release, not breaking him out. Yeah, I mean, he is a stickler for the law. Of course he would hate that. 
I've prepared a means for you to enter the palace dungeons. Pray. Take this. This mission demands the a jail key. Pray thee, be cautious, your Majesty. Secrecy? Wait, am I am I breaking him out? Should you be discovered, I will be unable to lend aught in the way of aid. Oh, son of a gun! It's a sneaking mission. Colliding into you and running off. Has no one any respect for the arisen in this city? Colliding. Huh? Colliding? Cage mag magistrate. Okay, it's not timed. Make use of the key you received from Captain Brandt to pay him a visit. So I would need to go to the south end of the ca of the noble quarter towards the castle. Uh, well, um, oh, are you playing a violin? That's neat. So I'm thinking nighttime would be the best cover for it, but it might be dawn soon. Which me? Oh my God, Parius! For the love of. I think we should move quickly, is what I'm saying. It's going to be daybreak soon. Let's try and break out that guy uh, very fast. Hello, Sir Guard. Uh, just a regular mercenary passing through. Don't mind me, I'm on official Hello. business. Oh. There are some locations that are entirely off limits, and others to which you will only be permitted entry at specific times of day. If the guard catches you on the palace grounds at night, you'll be apprehended and thrown in the jail for trespassing. Oh. Um. Dear master, I'll fare all right am I not allowed? Can, can I go in? Should I ask permission? It is not our place. <laughs> we are hardly familiar. Can I? Can I go in? Like it is the castle grounds, but. Uh, should I try during the day? Maybe they'll just run up and say, "Hey, no one allowed." Yeah, look at that guy. That's an adventurer. I, I'm allowed. I'm, I'm, I'm allowed here. Right. Okay, I think we're good. Um. Right. We're we're definitely good. We're we're definitely good. Oh, it's sunrise. Oh, this sucks. Need the cover of night. Maybe. Maybe. I am the worst sneak ever. Oh. Oh. Hello. I like the look of this. Also, I just noticed my pawns aren't with me. I don't think pawns are allowed in, in the castle grounds. A Jasper. Well, I like the look of this. It looks kind of like a prison, but I should be checking my corners. Or, oh, is this lantern oil? I feel like this might not be a way into. Oh, oh my God! A full suite of marchers' armor. What the hell? Uh. Oh, it's. It's worse, in a lot of ways, and it's weighing me down. Although this cape... Ooh, that's going on, hello! Ooh, I look really cool now. Uh, let me give that over to... Oh. Fine, I'm gonna do this while heavy. Rats. Hello, Bor Boreas. Hello. Oh, Seeker's token. Neat. I'm gonna do this while heavy. Oh, I, uh, uh. oh, wait, wait, I can jump out here, right? There we go. There's Boreas and the crew. Over here, guys. I need to pass something along to you. <sighs> Too far away. Come on.
There we go. Alright, Boreas, hold all this stuff for me. Thank you. Now I'm average. That is fine. That is respectable. We shall remain here. Don't mind me. Just just a normal well, Inspector. Everything is in order. Uh, hi. So, you've come. Captain Brant bade me allow you passage. Oh. Alright. In here, then. Going down. I like the looks of that. Castle Jail Tower. This is it. So a man out front let me in, but I have to assume... All the guards down here will not like my trespass. Oh man, I just realized, on our escape we can go out through the well! I'm glad I discovered that first. The route seems clear-ish. Easy does it, slow and steady, check my corners. Oh. I think I just saw someone. Are we good? <gasps> oh, he's coming this way. All right, go, go, go. Huh. Are we good? I think you might be able to look through that doorway, so let's be careful. I wish there was a crouch button. That would feel a lot more natural. Uh, hello? Where? He's looking at me. Why is he looking at me? Oh my god, this freaking camera. What the hell? How am I supposed to sneak past all them? Like this, I assume. Oh my god, they're coming this way. Shit. Okay. I need to be very careful here. Oh. Uh, uh, no, you know what? They're looking at me. I want... This was not a sneaking mission at all. Okay. I'm allowed to be here, but I need to not be seen while breaking the man out. So, who are you? Stay away from me. Galad. No, I'm looking for a W something. Yeah, of course I'm allowed to be here. I was let in at the front, right? Clearly I'm on official business. Right, right, right. What? 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 Why? What changed? Um, this is really bad. This is really bad. I don't want to hurt you. That's it. I've had enough. Oh my god. Help. 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 Ow. <laughs> Help. I'm getting bullied. Help me. I'm I can't move. Oh, he's pinning me down. Oh, I'm arrested. Oh, I... You know what? I just got an idea. What if I had put on that full set of armor I looted? Could I have been in disguise? <sighs> well... Crap. Yeah, I thought that looked weak. I'm missing all my gear, right? My whole inventory. Oh, I still have the jail key! That's nice, at least. But where's my stuff? Uh -uh. 
What did you expect sending a plate mail man on a sneaking mission? Oh. Putrid gold tooth. Ow. Freaking rat. Bats. That's what they are. Oh! Well, look at that. My whole kit got back. Huh. Just like magic. We found All right. Key, did we not? We shall await you here, master. I may have gotten my stuff back. I may have broken out of jail, but I have a mission to do. I will not leave until it is accomplished. Hello. Don't mind me. Nothing to see here. Don't mind the gaping hole in my cell. Are they gone? Wait for it. Wait for it. Now. Run. 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 Okay. Now, I realize I'm escaping out of the, uh... Radius of the quest, but this goes down. It'll double back. We'll be fine. This is the intended way to go. I'm sure W something's gonna be down here in the deepest dankest darkest pit and oh son of a Oh man I should very much like to rejoin you, Master. All right, Boreas. I'll set my shame aside. Let's see. So, here we go. My mage has healed me up, and I am now decked out in full-bodied disguise. I look exactly like the other guards. So, no one, not one soul, will think it amiss to see me walking through here. That's how it's going to be. Everything is going to go perfectly. How do you do, fellow guards? I am here to uh, cover your shift. No, 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 it's fine. You can leave. I'm here to cover your shift. Is there aught you require? Yeah. Off with you. Okay. It's fine to open this, right? The guards can go in here and talk to this prisoner. Have you come Waldar, it is you! Who are you? The Arisen, the real one. Uh -huh. Then we are presented with three options. Either the law of our world that allows only one Arisen has been upended, or Deezer's Arisen is false, or you are lying to me. Have you proof? That you are arisen, as you say. Ah, they say the arisen's breast bears a wound akin to the dragon's claw. By that mark, it seem it is true. This reminds me of a happening 148 years ago. During the reign of Regent Alphonse, a man named Crusoe appeared and claimed to be arisen. He went before the people, insisting that he, and not Regent Alphonse, was the true Arisen. 
the one fit to lead them as their ruler. And what befell him, you ask? Ha! Crusoe was discovered to be a liar, whereupon his head was liberated from his shoulders on the spot. Aye, I dare say your arrival portends another beheading, but whose will it be, hmm? The pretender on the throne right now. <sighs> Urge him to stop talking. You know, I'm just going to tell him to escape. Escape? But why? Here, I spend my days perusing the code and deciphering old texts. I can devote all my time to my own interests. And I need not turn my ear to Deesa's absurd demands. It is a paradise to me, this cell. But sir, when I'm declared sovereign, I'll set you up in the nicest library office you have uh, that we have, and you can spend your time in isolation and comfort. That said, if you know of a place with a mountain of tomes I could delve into, I might rethink the matter. Oh, for the love of... Tell me, does that ring any bells? I suspected as much. Then we are done here. Leave... The Magistrate seeks a place to quench his thirst for knowledge. Where might we find one, I wonder? Are you kidding I'm not me? Sure what to tell you. I went through all that and... Oh. I'm really upset. I'm really upset. I'm really, really upset. <laughs> God, I don't even know where to begin the search. Is there a library nearby? Would I get answers just by asking around? Or, uh, hey guys, hey, uh, man. All right. Well, I tried. We'll come back to this, and I'll certainly remember this entrance um, near to the slums. And I'll have to remember to wear my friggin' disguise when I go. <sighs> well, I guess that beggars a question. Now what? Our, our attempt at infiltrating has been not successful, and then it ended in failure, because the guy just won't leave. Now what? Uh, I guess we'll just poke around, ask about where to go. Hello. Suppose you're all right. Yeah, I am. Uh, maybe this fine building right here is a library. Governing soul. What is that? Uh, invokes halidum. Cures debilitations. Neat. The Gracious Hand. It looks like, um, some sort of church or aid mission place. Yeah, I guess they care for the sickly here. You know what? Maybe, just maybe, if I look at the map of the city and I hover over these, uh, these flags, maybe I can learn something. Ox cart, uh, towns and estate, comptroller, watchheads, Baldwin, Rose Chateau. Uh, maybe, maybe it could be Rose Chateau. Oh, for the love of diviner salon, diviner. What is a diviner? Maybe. I could ask this diviner of where I should go to find a place with lots of books to read. Huh. That's it. I've had enough. Clear off. And don't come back till you're ready to do business properly. I recognize that man at the stand. He's the guy I did not narc on when a guard was chasing him. But I've got the coin. I swear it. I simply just... Sven, Where huh? is it then, eh? Bring the coin, all of it. 
or I'll call the sentinels on you again. Are we clear? It is uncommon for a lad of his age to be unable. Mm -hmm. Oh, tis you. Oh, you're the good <laughs> sir who aided me in now. A lot of things are happening at once. Hi, Flora. Thank you again, sir. You don't know how grateful I am to you. Cool. Maybe I'll catch you around. Um. Well met, sir. Forgive my presumption, but were you the one who gave my granddaughter that medicine in Melv? Yeah, that was me. I thought so. <laughs> She's not stopped talking of her adventure since she arrived home. You have my sincerest thanks for aiding her. Didn't I call this? I totally call this exact thing happening. That girl's always running off on some fool's errand or other. For all my chiding. Once she gets an idea under her bonnet, there's simply no talking her out of it. Now listen, tisn't much, but I'd fain offer you a discount on my wares. Pray, make good use of it, won't you? A discount, you say? I'll take you up on that offer. Welcome and well met. Don't think I forgot... Ornate box. Something small can be stored within the internal compartment... Interesting, but... Huh. Yeah, I'll, I'll buy it, just because I'm really curious about what it is. Huh. Your discount now. I'll knock a few gold pieces off or two buy. So spend away, my good sir. Always a pleasure. Alright, Sven, thank you for your patience. Let's get to it. Oh, tis you. You're a welcome sight. Forgive my boldness, but I've a small favor to ask of you. Would you be willing to lend me some gold? I swear you'll be repaid in full. I am pretty wit rich. I have uh, 13,000. Uh, I wish. 1,300, rather. Um, oh wait, here? Give her an eight box. Yeah, we just saw him arguing about this box, right? Whoa, here. I don't believe it. How did you know I wanted this? Huh. Yeah, I heard you talking about it. Never mind. I'll treasure it all the same. You've my thanks, sir. And pray, let me return the favor someday. I bought it at a discount. He spoke of returning the favor. But what could a lad of his age possibly muster? Well, he's dressed like a noble, so that it might come in aid in unexpected and useful ways. Anywho. Gather round, gather round. Treat your ears to a tale by a um, I'm pretty rich, and I have quite a bit of stuff to sell. Maybe, just maybe, I can get Boreas a nicer pair of pants. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? <laughs> Welcome to Bjorn's Armory, and quality is what you need if you want to survive. My god. These panties we're in right now are better than everything. <laughs> Maybe I can get him a shirt that covers that. Um. That kind of covers it. You know? Oh. Okay, that doesn't. Uh. That does! Look at that! Scale jacket! That's gonna take like all my gold, but it's for my pawn, it's a colossal upgrade, and it makes me so I don't have to look at his bare butt anymore, so. Equip. So if we check. And, before I forget, we will enhance it! Asp Toxis Scale? The hell? I have no idea where to begin looking for that. Oh, I suppose we can upgrade his new pants too. Hasarian Scale for that, huh? Ah, yes, I can finally upgrade his uh, rugged... Not, his throat cutters with these rugged bones we got from that Cyclops. I knew I was onto something. Perfect.
Why not? I'll just throw 26 gold at the shield. Price, just remember, hope to see you again. Quite the sum of gold we just spent. Just clear the Arisen is no miser.